you know it's going to happen. We, we got like As he celebrates 25 years in the biz with the 2,441st star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. Today, Hollywood honors Simon Fire. Before you get to hear from Henry, let me tell you a little bit about him. I understand he just celebrated a birthday last week, May the 17th. He was born on Cyprus an island in the Mediterranean where his father, a teacher, was based. 25-year career is marked by innovation and number one hits in television, film, music, sports, and fashion. Simon has accumulated a formidable reputation for his work with the Spice Girls, one of the most successful girl groups of all time. Then he dreamed up one of the world's biggest TV franchises, American Idol. But first, he first appeared on American Idol back in 2002. And he has hosted, get this, every single episode of the show since. Yeah! He also received his star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame in 2005. Please welcome Walk of Fame Ryan Seacrest. Throughout the years, hundreds of people have fueled American Idol, those on the TV production, those as part of the concert tour, our sponsors, our partners, and all of us are grateful that you decided to bring this show to America 10 years ago. Yeah! Academy of Country Music Awards for Entertainer of the Year in 2009 and 2010. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Carol Underwood to the show. like to say that I am very, very honored to be here today um, sharing in this for you. Um, Simon Fuller is a genius and a visionary. 
He has forever changed the face of the entertainment world, and along the way, he even made some dreams come true for a lot of people, myself included, obviously. And I know that I would not be anywhere near where I am today if it wasn't for Simon. You never know what he's going to come up with next, and I know that I am always looking forward to whatever that is going to be. I can't wait to see uh, all the, the crazy things he's up to and, um, and the things that he's going to do in the future. You have earned this. You deserve this more than anybody that I know. And on behalf of all of the lives that you've changed forever, thank you so much. And now it's time to hear from our honoree, but let me just be like... Well, you have no idea how bizarre, strange, awkward, and uh, many other words I feel right now, because you know I'm usually sitting over there, yeah. or back there, or up there, and, and very rarely by myself in the spotlight. And it's, um, actually it's great. I think I should do my own reality show. No? <laughs> It's actually very awkward for me, and um, so excuse my um, fumbled words. My whole career has been defined purely and simply by the talent, the artists, the people that I manage, and the people that I work with. That's why when I sit over there, I'm actually way prouder than I, than I am now. My dreams come from making other people's dreams come true. Whenever I see that star, I won't see my name, I'll see all the names of all the people I've worked with and all those amazing artists and people that, that have helped me achieve all this stuff. Um, so really, uh, this is my way of saying thank you to all the artists I've worked with. Two names spring to mind, maybe three immediately. And the first name, who's a guy I love so much, is Nigel Lithgow. I will always be most proud when I see artists up here, artists conquering the world, and us entrepreneurs and executives sit back and celebrate their glory. Now. 